What's up, guys? So we got some news here. Quarterback Tua Tungavailoa was named starter for the Dolphins. This is coming from ESPN's Adam Schefter. And this, is, of course, comes after Tua made his debut last week. He played five total snaps. He had two completions for nine yards. It was nothing really too impressive, but... Considering this is a guy who had had a very devastating hip injury, seeing him being able to roll out and how mobile he was, was really encouraging to see. So he will be making his start. He won't be playing this week because the Dolphins are on a bye. But in the following week, he'll be going up against the Los Angeles Rams. So first game as a starter, he has a pretty difficult opponent here. He will be going up against, of course, Aaron Donald, a former Defensive Player of the Year, and then Jalen Ramsey, who was always regarded as one of the elite cornerbacks in the NFL. So it will definitely be one of the tougher matchups for Tua in his first game as the starter. But when it comes to Tua in general, the fact that the Dolphins did not elect to have a third string quarterback says a lot about their confidence in his ability, at least health wise. So that is always a good thing to hear. And then uh, Fitzpatrick was just a tremendous job at being a bridge quarterback. Tua had a ton of praise for him and how he was able to mentor him until he got to this point. And then Ryan Fitzpatrick was also very aware of what he was. He knew that he was the bridge to Tua and he was fine with taking on that role of teaching him as much as he could. Fitzpatrick's been on a ton of teams throughout his career. He has a ton of knowledge. As we all know, Fitzpatrick is a former Harvard student from back in college. So just a ton of things that Tua was able to pick up on to get to this point. But nonetheless, it was still regarded as news that is pretty shocking. A ton of people are very optimistic about Tua's ability and what he's able to do. And again, against a very tough Rams defense and with an offensive line that consists of two rookies and two veterans who are in their first season with the team. And then on top of that, you consider that on the opposite side the Rams have an offense that is very high octane they like to keep the pace very fast this is going to be a very interesting game for Tua as his first game as a starter and then one little final side note here Tua, he wears the jersey number one. He will be playing this game on November the 1st, 11-1 at 1 p.m. Eastern time. So people who are into numbers and are superstitious or numerology, there you have it. I mean, this is all lined up to be his moment. So guys, let me know what you think. Do you think it's the right time to have Tua in there? Do you think it will be a tough matchup against the Rams and maybe they should have waited a little bit longer or is this the perfect time? Feel free to follow me on Twitter if you want to at via the source or at Shady Steven. And if you could leave a review on the Apple Podcast app or if you're listening to this on YouTube, if you could subscribe, that would be a tremendous help. Guys, until next time, I'm Steven Masso and this was via the source.